um, well guys, um, this is the seventh uh, video of uh, how to make a POS. Um, in the last video, I told you that I will teach you how to make a login. Um, but unfortunately, we miss a couple of things here. Uh, I didn't really teach you how to um, enable the delete command. So in this video, we'll tackle that one. For starters, go to your dataset, and you need to create this command, the, the delete customer's ID command. So I'll show you how to make that. Um, right click here, and just put, uh, just click on Add Query. Click Next, and click on Delete. So this. Uh, um, Visual Basic will generate this code for you. So what we'll do is we'll delete the field or our data on our data set using a customer ID. So apart from delete everything apart from the customer ID. So after that, click next and name your function whatever you want it. And click next then it will say generate and delete statement so just click finish I'll just click cancel after that build your program build your program after building your program then we can start coding oh yeah click on your design view double click on the delete command on your on your tool strip menu, double click it and type the following code. So, a couple of things first. Uh, we need to <coughs> make a, a command that will not trigger the delete command if the form is empty. So, what we'll do here is we just have to create an if statement so if text box one dot text is equals to empty then exit sub then let's start oh, if if it is not empty then customer ta dot delete customer id Text box one <coughs> text and customer ITA dot bill IDS dot customer TV then customer <coughs> TA dot dispose okay it's that simple guys so uh try your code so let's just try the code now so file customers ta uh, if you click delete nothing will happen oh wait a minute before we proceed, let us have the Visual Basic inform us if um, we were able to successfully delete something. One record. Try the code again. <coughs> if we click on the delete button, nothing is happening. So let's search for one of the fields here. Oops. And click delete button. 
as you can see, we be informed us that one record was deleted. Now let's check on our database. And there you go, Nancy Drew is deleted. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Anyway, uh, just practice and um, try to develop something out of the things you've learned here. Um, programming is easy if you just try and recall this experiment on what you know. So anyway, um, hopefully I'll make the next video here about the login uh, soon. As of this time, uh, I'm really busy. So anyway, enjoy and happy coding guys.